ट्रांसपोर्टेशन वेलकम टू द लेसन ट्रांसपोर्टेशन इन दिस लेसन यू विल लर्न टू एक्सप्लेन इन डिटेल द रोडवेज सिस्टम इन आंध्र प्रदेश एक्सप्लेन इन डिटेल द रेलवेज सिस्टम इन आंध्र प्रदेश एक्सप्लेन इन डिटेल द वॉटर वेज सिस्टम इन आंध्र प्रदेश एक्सप्लेन इन डिटेल द एयरवेज सिस्टम इन आंध्र प्रदेश people had to travel on foot for long distances once upon a time as transport facilities were meager due to the revolutionary progress that has taken place in the transport sector in our state one can reach the far corners of the country within hours people travel from one place to another in a quick and safe manner due to the developed transport facilities The commercial sector has also developed due to quick transportation. Road, rail, waterways and airways in the state are playing their pivotal role in the economic development by transporting men and material. Roadways are very important to transport people and goods. Andhra Pradesh has a length of over 2 lakh kilometers of roadways out of this road length 1 lakh 9430 kilometers are under zilla parishad 61039 kilometers of road network is maintained by the state rnb department these include 8201 kilometers of state highways and 34605 kilometers of major district roads 12 national highways run through andhra pradesh the length of these national highways is 4104 kilometers the total number of all types of motor vehicles in andhra pradesh is 45 The Andhra Pradesh State Road Transport Corporation also known as the APSRTC operates a fleet of over 19000 buses in addition to the APSRTC buses private buses also apply in the state railways transport people and goods in large quantities quickly to distant places The total length of railways in Andhra Pradesh is 5107 kilometers. 4436 kilometers of the total length are broad gauge. 634 kilometers of the total length of railways are meter gauge. 37 kilometers of the total length of railways are narrow gauge. There are 635 railway stations in Andhra Pradesh. The railways in Andhra Pradesh are under the jurisdiction of South Central Railway, Southern Railway and South Eastern Railway zones. A total of 1000 kilometers of railways are electrified. Goods can be transported with low transport costs on a large scale through waterways Andhra Pradesh has a coastline of about 972 kilometers there are 10 sea ports in Andhra Pradesh Visakhapatnam has a very big natural harbor it is the biggest sea port in Andhra Pradesh export and import of goods on a large scale take place through this port kakinada and machili patnam are medium size sea ports the other seven sea ports are minor sea ports godavari krishna and penna river and their canals in the delta 
are important inland waterways. These rivers and canals are used to transport goods. The canals of the river Krishna have a length of about 1000 kilometers. The canals of the river Godavari have a length of about 800 kilometers. The length of Buckingham Canal is about 310 kilometers. Air transport, though expensive, enables us to travel from one place to another very quickly. There are five domestic aerodromes in Andhra Pradesh. They are Begumpet in Hyderabad, Vishakhapatnam, Ganavaram near Vijaywada, Puttaparthi and Tirupati, also known as Renigunta. In addition to the five domestic airports, there are also four minor airports in Andhra Pradesh. They are located at Rajamundri, Kadappa, Donakonda and Varangal. Begumpet Airport is an international airport. A new international airport is being constructed at Shamshabad, Hyderabad. You have reached the end of the lesson Transportation. In this lesson, you have learned to Explain in detail the roadways system in Andhra Pradesh. Explain in detail the railways system in Andhra Pradesh. Explain in detail the waterways system in Andhra Pradesh. Explain in detail the airways system in Andhra Pradesh.